Comes live in Sacramento with all the juicy details. <laughs> Woo! Can you see it's me? Smoking. Yes, yes. It's like a music video. I feel like I should be dancing. Hey, hey. Uh, da, 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 hey. Uh, yeah, Momo's Meat Market right off of Broadway in 58th in Sacramento is cooking up a lot of meat. This is every day for them. Now, if you know this area, you know that you can likely smell the barbecue in the neighborhood. Or if you're driving by, you'll see just this. You'll see a lot of smoke. Uh, but let me tell you something. They've been at this now for almost 10 years, and they, the community, I should say, love uh, Glenn here and his wife, who opened again this business uh, now almost 10 years. Glenn, thanks for hanging out with us. Thank you. Thanks for coming out. We appreciate of it. Of course. So a couple of things. Let's kind of start with what you all have been doing during this global pandemic. Uh, we have video here just a few minutes ago, guys. Uh, we saw a bus come in and picked up some barbecue to take to uh, some senior citizens. Glenn, tell me a little bit about that and why you all decided to do this. Yeah, we put in for that. It helps us also, but it was from the uh, the mayor and the city council, and they came up with the idea to feed the uh, feed the elderly. So, uh, 30 restaurants were chosen, and we happen to be one of them. And we've been feeding them now for two weeks. Wow! And this is for you guys. Like you said, it helps you as well. But that's going to make you feel good to know that you're helping out folks in the community. Yes. Well, you know, it, it makes us feel good. But I think you know, with uh, all of the restaurants that are suffering right now. It, it really it really does help us. Yeah. Okay, this yeah. is awesome. Let's go ahead and open this up. Now, I said, Glenn, I want to know all the secrets, and you, you said you would give me a few uh, tricks here and tips. Tell me what you do with this meat, and what, what are we looking at here? Okay, here we have the tri-tip. I sear it real hot to hold in the juices, and then I slow it down and smoke it. Woo! My goodness. Okay, should we switch grills? Yeah. All right, let's, hide, let's hop on over here. We're going to open up this bad boy. Uh-oh. I'm trying not to distract him. If you guys have been over here, you see Glenn. He's out here every single day flipping meat. I can't find him. Hold on. Glenn, are you there? Oh, there you are. Okay. <laughs> All right, so what do we have over here? We have our tri-tip. We have our ribs and our links. Okay. The links I have on the cool end, they slow smoke. The ribs here, I'm doing the same as the tri-tip. I'm searing it hot, and then I'll slow it down and smoke it. All right, so one thing people might not know is, yes, you can come and get already cooked uh, meat barbecue, of course, um, but you can also come and get that raw, correct? That's correct. We usually have you order the raw the day before, but we carry some things like our hog head cheese and uh, a few steaks and things like that. But most of the things you have to order the day before, and we'll have it within 24 hours. All right, what's your go-to? What's uh, the most popular item on the menu? Uh, the ribs right now. With the holiday going on this weekend, we're selling more ribs than anything else. All right. And what time you, you guys are already open, correct? Or what time do you guys uh, open we up? We open at 11. All right. We're open at 11. Okay. We just came in this morning for the to feed the elderly. Okay, awesome. All right, there it is. Going to open that up because I want that smoke as we get All ready right. to toss back. Oh, there it is. Back over to you. See you later. Awesome. Can oh. you see me later? <laughs> yep.